slasher films are characterized by mundane settings of relevance to middle-class American teenagers, e.g. summer camps, high school dance halls, and the suburbs. A group of sybaritic youngsters and shadowy, usually knife-wielding killers. Most of the action in these films occurs in a single, isolated non-urban location where a killer clandestinely and closely monitors his her young victims' actions before offing them through close-up attacks. trajectory to threat. The killer targets a group of hedonistic youth for killing. Part 2. Disruption 3. Leisure. Youths interact recreationally in an insular quotidian location for stalking. A shadow tracks the youths in that location. 5. Murdering. The shadowy killer kills some of the youths. Part 3. Resolution 6. Confrontation. The remaining character as challenges the killer. 7. Neutralization. The immediate threat posed by the killer is eliminated. People are very rarely stalked and murdered by psychopaths in masks, and yet because of the structure of the human fear module, that narrative situation grips and holds our attention. Such films provide a hormone-drenched setting for social displays of mastery and romantic bonding. Effective slasher films exploit evolved defense mechanisms to produce strong emotional responses. They provide a context for romantic 